I be damned. I be damned. I be damned. I could have swore plenty of times on this channel. We've had other topics similar to this, you know, around this kind of situations, exactly some of these situations. And there's a lot of people who are in the comments section talking about, oh, you playing the race card. Oh, you race baiting. There's no racism in Formula One. Bullshit. 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 See, I want to know what you say now. I want to know what you say now. I want to know what your excuse, what your read, what, no, it ain't even a reason. A reason is something that val validly can prove something else. Has, has, a, has some type of real information to it of why I said things happen. I want to know your butthole ass excuse for how this is going to be acceptable, how this is pulling the race car. Your dude's up here streaming in his own confine. He chilling. And he using the N-word. That's what's being reported anyway. Racial slurs is what's being put on all of these forearms. But it's reportedly said he used the N-word. I just got to ask y'all. This is not the first time this happened in Red Bull, right? No, 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 it's not. It's not. Remember when Christian Horner, Karen Horney, went and excited that whole race shit that happened. Now, I'm not talking about racing four wheels on the black top. I'm talking about racism, damn outlash against Lewis Hamilton by going and trying to be some diva about the fact that Lewis and Max got into a racing incident and spiked this whole thing. Matter of fact, it was so bad, not only did another employee get fired then, I believe, but also... They put out a statement talking about they renounced that. We don't deal with that. But Honda came out and doubled down and said it was disgusting. Now, another year, back to back. Here we go again. Red Bull shirt on. Red Bull teammate up here calling people the N-word while he's streaming, playing games and shit. But, that, but it ain't, ain't no racism in Formula One. Or I'm just pulling the race car. It's mighty funny. Like, you know, there's no, this is not a coincidence. This can't be Red Bull cannot members of Red Bull cannot not know that these guys are racist. You cannot not know this. There has to be somebody that he's talked to about this, his mannerism about this. But you know what it is? I think it's acceptable by Red Bull. I think this is something that Red Bull finds acceptable within their organization so long as it doesn't come out to the public so long as you don't tweet it or do something on social media, so long as you don't get randomly caught on streaming games and call somebody a ass. I'm just going to, there ain't no ban. Yuri Vips, Vips, you in the shit and suspended, suspended. Okay, first, let's, let's, let's do this. Let's do this. <clears throat> let's look at, let's look at Yuri's statement. Let's look at this statement. He says, I wish to unreservedly apologize for the offensive language used during a live gaming stream earlier today. This language is entirely unacceptable and does not portray the values and the principles that I hold. And I'm glad you used the lowercase I because I really don't believe you. Deeply regret my actions and this is not the example I wish to set. I will cooperate with the investigating investigation fully. Yuri, listen, let me tell you something. Everybody, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. You, they're always sorry when now they got something that they might lose that they really been working for. If he never gets caught on this gaming stream, if nobody ever brings it to the light, do you think Yuri's writing this shit and another light saying, you know what, y'all? I used some language this past weekend. And I don't feel right about it, and, and it's just, I got to do better. No. No, he doesn't. He does not come out. He keeps living his racist-ass life, keeps calling people that, especially behind closed doors where he's comfortable with family members and friends alike that agree with it, at least. Keeps working for Red Bull, which is full of shit in, uh, in, this, in this department. I mean, damn. This is not a legitimate, this is not a real statement or real apology this is some bullshit let me see if i can save my junior driving ass career whatever i do in red bull can i manage to salvage something that i really care about 
because he don't care. Evidently, don't care about black people, right? But but you know what, Formula One, I blame you too, because then you soften up your stance on kneeling to show respect and support for the injustice of black people around the world, of people of color around the world. Didn't you slow your stance on that? Yeah, you did. So you showed people in your organization how you really felt about that when it came down to it. It was cool when it was really marketable. But what are you going to do when it's just something to do when having integrity? We see what you did. And this is by far another result. He got comfortable. He got comfortable. He thought it was okay. I can do that. No, you can't do that. No, you shouldn't do that. And hell no, I don't accept your apology because you're not sorry for what you did. You're only sorry for what you might possibly lose. That's what the hell you're sorry about. Let's look at Red Bull's statement. Red Bull Racing has suspended junior driver Yuri Vips from all team duties with immediate effect pending a full investigation into the incident. As an organization, we condemn abuse of any kind and have a zero tolerance policy to racist language or behavior within our organization. Says the fuck who? Says who? Can't be zero. Can't be zero. Zero poly. Can't be zero percent. Zero nothing. It can't be zero. Now, I might believe other teams if they say that. Because they ain't coming out back to back with this or with drivers or with them in organization or people that's working there about having to do this shit like this. A lot of other a lot of other teams fans and I'm not saying that there aren't other teams with fans that are racist because there are racist ass fans of Formula One. But we have seen in the real time Red Bull racist ass fans on social media disrespecting calling Lewis Hamilton the n-word and all types of other monkeys and bullshit like that we have seen this from Red Bull's fan dumb ship so we know in your organization the shit exists and it's proof it exists but y'all gonna let me see a hater in the comments that's about this some race bait and shit. This is right. This is fake news. Man, if you don't get the fuck out of here with that, y'all kill me. But hey, there you go. You asked for it. Hey, I didn't say it. He said it. I didn't do it. Red Bull did it. So hey, I, I just want to know: Is it a race car now? Is this a race car now? Or are you gonna? You not gonna click on this video because you know you dead to right, wrong as hell, right? Yeah, I know because some of y'all races are shit too. That's the problem. But that's okay. I be seeing y'all. Trust me. And then hell, the comment. Y'all be mad because your because your racist ass comments don't make it to my comment section because my filter is pretty decent and it catches y'all up. But I be seeing all that shit in my hell up comments. I seen it. That's all right. So right, we're going to keep building. Hey, we're going to be back here live. All big shout out to all the new members posted y'all up there. Don't forget to hit the members only uh, community post and vote on the next bottle that we will buy to pop here on the channel when Mercedes gets another podium. Do that. Uh, if I don't have that one up, I definitely got another one up that y'all are supposed to be voting on. So keep that in mind. Also, Tier 2 of the VIP program is coming. Tier 2, I already have the products on the way. Uh, the other product that has to be custom made to put the products in is a little delay. But Tier 2 of the VIP program, just like the VIP boxes, there's another Tier 2 coming that you all will be able to earn. I will always try to find a continuous way to give back to you all because you all show me much love, respect, and support here. And I want to show you my appreciation, all right? So, hey, I'm out. Just build it. Peace. Thanks for tuning in and watching another video here at Wolfpack Performance. Check out some of my other content on Formula One issues, our topics, and our DIY products on how to customize your vehicle. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. See you soon.